Praise the Lord, beloved of the Most High God, in the mighty name of King Jesus. I just wanted to touch bases with you all and let you know that I am doing okay. It is well with my soul that even with the passing of my grandmother and the battles that I'm doing both spiritually and then against this flesh that we all have to endure on a daily basis, that it is still well with my soul. Praise the Lord Jesus. I also wanted to share something with you that is a spiritual warfare prayer that I think will be a blessing to you. For those of you who are doing battle in the flesh against either the flesh or the world or the devil, it really makes no difference. Whatever you're dealing with, the name of Jesus and the power of the Lord Jesus Christ is greater. So, let's see. You proclaim this out loud. Father, I submit myself to the Lord Jesus Christ. I hereby resist you, Satan, for this thing and whatever it is. Whatever the temptation is, whether it's the world coming against you, the flesh coming against you, the devil, name that temptation, name what the object is. You have spoken or brought to me is a weapon formed against me to tempt me, to ensnare me, to bind me, and destroy me. Everything you speak is a lie or a deception, and I rebuke you, Satan. And then whatever that desire is or name or temptation is or weakness is, and again, attack, name it. Right now, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Flesh, submit yourself right now to the power and authority of the Lord Jesus Christ. I humble myself to his power and authority right now. I submit myself to the power of the Holy Spirit and command you flesh to be surrendered and submitted to him. Thank you, Father, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Now, the world, the flesh, or the devil is still under subjection of the authority of the Lord Jesus Christ, and you are making your declaration and proclamation in faith, in his power, not your own, not even in your declaration, but in his power. And you are simply aligning yourself and getting agreement, getting into agreement with the Lord Jesus Christ and his power and his authority that he has delegated to you. So when the devil comes to you, when the temptation comes to you, When your flesh rises up and says, I want you to do this thing, whatever it is, here's what you should pray. And I'm going to to say it again without any interruption all the way through. Proclaim aloud, Father, I submit myself to the Lord Jesus Christ. I hereby resist you, Satan, for this thing. Name it. You have spoken or brought to me is a weapon formed against me to tempt me. Ensnare me, bind me, and destroy me. Everything you speak is a lie or a deception. And I rebuke you, Satan. Name it, desire, whatever it is. Right now, in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Flesh, submit yourself right now to the power and authority of the Lord Jesus Christ. I humble myself to his power. And authority, right now, I submit myself to the power of the Holy Spirit and command you flesh to be surrendered and submitted to him. Thank you, Father, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Pray this as many times per day as is necessary against the devil, against the flesh, 
against the world, if anything comes up against you, you pray it as many times as needed. Don't be dissuaded. You're going to stand on the rock, which is Christ. You're going to stand on his word. And every time the devil comes to you, you're going to speak the word of the Lord Jesus Christ against him. Just like the Lord did. When Satan came to him to tempt him, he spoke the word. He said, it is written. And what you can do also is find scriptures. If there are some pertaining to your particular situation and circumstance, get them, clip them out. Put them up where you can see them plainly and say them aloud against the devil when he comes at you. In the mighty name of King Jesus, rebuke that old serpent. I hope this will be a blessing to you, beloved. It will help you fight in your struggle against the world, the flesh, or the devil. Be blessed, beloved of the Most High God, in the mighty name of King Jesus. Amen.